yeah, yeah, I'm in traffic, nigga. Yeah, yeah, I'm in this bumper to bumper traffic. I'm in this bumper to bumper motherfucking traffic. So guess what? Here we go, guys. I need some motherfucking company. I need some mother one love back to you, my nigga. Say what's up, ATL. I see you rocking with it. What's up with it, King? I already zoom in on y'all, nigga. Who we sick? We done heard all the eye jokes you can tell. Your pocket still broke. <laughs> See, I keep coming up with new jokes. <laughs> on the ground with it already. Uh, tell Dirk to slide. Uh, how, we just start blocking these niggas. See, a nigga come in saying some stupid shit, just block them. That's how we do that, though. Nigga come in and say some stupid shit, just block them. Oh, uh, you never not like rappers. You just always going to men block. Nigga, you don't know nothing about nothing. You just in your type of play suicide doors. Block, nigga. Stop making requests, nigga. This ain't no motherfucking radio station. Yeah, just go to blocking niggas typing stupid shit. Yeah, uh, just got my already. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, uh, just block anybody talking stupid shit. Yeah. Yeah, nigga say something stupid, block, get the fuck out of here. It's a dumb ass nigga. Find something else better to write about. It. What's up with it, big dog? I just done made it back. Say, nigga, hey, listen, Tampa Bay, Florida. Just get behind me, bitch. You trying to cut in front of me, bitch. Just get behind me, ho. That's all you got to do. Just slow down. I don't want no bitch cutting in front of me right now. <laughs> I don't want to be in traffic. I just got off the motherfucking plane. Bitch want to cut in front of me. Bitch, just ease on behind me, ho. <laughs> what you think about the NBA freezing? Block. Nigga, I don't know nothing about the NBA. But I do know something about this here. Whoever that nigga Jalen Green is. Man, what that nigga just did that shit for? Block. Block his motherfucking ass. That nigga Jalen Green need to be banned from the NBA. That nigga with the Houston Rockets. That was, that, that, that was dry heat. Yeah, man, that nigga, that's a sick shit. No, man, they, that nigga need to be fine. For, uh, uh, he, that nigga there is, man, I, I want to say that nigga there is imposturing a punk, but he a real punk. And the nigga laid there with his legs open, letting that nigga dry hump. Man, that nigga, man, that nigga devil fucked him. That's how the devil fucked. That's how I'm gonna go to sleep. That's how the devil fuck you. Man, that nigga let that nigga, that nigga just laid there with it, man. I'm glad I see why the rocket me trade that motherfucker right now. Get that bitch off my motherfucking team. And this motherfucker, Jalen motherfucker, they need to gay bash his ass in the locker room. Now, I ain't no gay bad. Well, I am, but I don't promote it. I am a gay bad, but I don't promote it. They need to kick his mother. It's a movie. It's a motherfucking military movie where it's a fat motherfucker. He kept fucking up in this military movie. And they put this motherfucking sheet over him and they beat his motherfucking ass with that soap and with that goddamn... I can't think of the name of that motherfucking military movie. Uh, they need to do that boy like that. Jalen Green, they need to... Every time he... De that motherfucker need to be hard fired every time he shoot the man. Just get him out the league. Get his mother... Who thought... What made... And the niggas in the room. That's like a mur That's like a crime being committed in full metal jacket. That's the name of it. They need to do that boy just like that. They need to beat his motherfucking ass. His, man, I'm talking about... It probably be some people standing outside in mama house protesting. Fuck your boy. Fuck that, man. I'm talking about... It's supposed to be some extreme shit going on like... What happened to George Floyd? All NBA supporters. And I'm not no NBA fan watching motherfucker. I always knew the nigga was gay. Nigga got, they pat each other's on the butts and all type of shit. But now listen, it's supposed to be some extreme outrage going on. These two tall ass giraffe ass niggas. Man, that was some sick shit. I'm traumatized. I'm not bullshitting my nigga. We need to gay bash the shit out that nigga. I'm talking about calling faggot. Punk! I'm talking about we need to holler out some real mean gay slurs to his motherfucking ass. I'm not lying, man. No, man. And the boy that just laid there. The boy laid there with his legs in missionary. Man, that nigga was supposed to have been throwing them long motherfucking arms at that nigga coming up with them elbow. Man, please. That nigga just laid. They been doing that shit. Man, and the nigga that recorded it. Oh, everybody in violation in it, man, man, oh, I'm fucked up, I was fucked up, man, I was on an airplane, man, I was fucked up, man, I'm not bullshit, 
I want to say some mean, hateful shit that'll get me counseled forever. But I ain't. I'm not going to do it. Things are going too motherfucking well in the comedy world. But, man, I want to say some mean shit to them tall sissies. I'm not bullshit. Them fucking motherfucking niggas. Just, man, I told you them bitch ass niggas. They take away basketball from them niggas and they be doing. They be just some tall, freaky punks. Yeah, <laughs> long leg motherfucker. Yeah, I'm talking about he rabbit fucking that boy. Man, he been on the fucking. Man, that's like, man, no, man, no, man. All the Houston Rockets, the whole team is supposed to be saying, man, we want him off this motherfucking team now. We want him off this team unless y'all down with it. He's supposed to be banned from every motherfucking male locker room in the National Basketball of Association League. He shouldn't be allowed in. He, should, he can't take showers with nobody. Nothing. Nothing. This fucking motherfucker done violated everything. Michael, man, God. Why Kobe turning over in his goddamn grave? Kobe Bryant is turning over in his motherfucking grave. Man, please, somebody speak out against this boy. Somebody tell this boy he's a he's a low down, dirty motherfucking punk, and he need to bring his faggot ass out the closet. Tell him, somebody tell him just like what I'm saying. Tell him you need to bring your faggot ass out the closet, yellow nigga. Fucking motherfucker in the borderland. No, both of them. Both of them need to be traded today. The boy that laying out with his leg, letting that man, man, that boy leg too motherfucking long. Later, so subservient. Man, that nigga that didn't have no fight in him. He want the dick. He want the dick. And then while I'm on this topic here, let me just say this. Big Boogie, stop letting them niggas. Hold you up while you hump the motherfucking air on stage. That don't look too good either. Cause once you go to humping good, he humping with you. And he on your back humping. Boogie don't let him do that no more, Boogie. I'm telling you, this shit is getting too crazy, man. A nigga, when a nigga go to wiggling and twiggling his motherfucking hip, if, he, if a nigga ain't getting his dick sucked, nobody should be around. Should know if y'all ain't flipping a bit. Yeah, high-fiving one another, flipping a hoe. Ain't no nigga making body contact and he playing hula hoop game. A hula hoop game is a solo action. You by yourself hula hooping. Your buddy can't hold your back. He can't shake your hand. None of that during hula hooping. I'm just, no, nah, man. I didn't like that big boogie shit. I ain't no, that ain't a good look, boogie. Fuck it, you talking about you on stage. He holding you. You humping like a motherfucker. I, I'm looking. I said, okay, them hoes like that. When you go to getting carried away, your buddy humping too, nigga, and he in the middle of your back with that dick. I said, oh, no, nah, he got to stop that. He he must ain't looking at it. He ain't, he ain't, he said, oh, no, nah, no, nah, stop it, nigga. Matter of fact, all niggas get off stage. Every, every nigga get off stage, go over there, nigga, say y'all go over there. Nigga, fuck, there ain't no niggas on stage no more. This is a one-man show. That's why Bobby Brown left New Edition. Michael Jackson quit his brother. Nigga, this is a one-man show. I'm the only nigga up here. Say that, no, get gone, nigga. Fuck you, nigga, play football. Nigga, I'm on stage doing my, that's why I'm a comedian, nigga. Ain't no other nigga on stage looking me upside my head, pumping into me, trying to get a dance down, none of that motherfucking shit. No, no, we got to start letting the ground rules down, fella. This shit is this shit is going all the way left now. This shit, say, listen, we got NBA player. Say, man, listen, what made them do that? We need a, a ESPN, whatever that shit is, and we need we need the fans. Say, what conversation was going on in this motherfucking room? With you high jumping, dribbling ass niggas, that it led to you and your teammate spiritually fucking. Cause y'all was, I don't give a fuck what you say. In my mind, you were pushing dick in that boy, and he was feeling it. That's why he was laying there. Ain't no, there ain't no motherfucking shit like that, man. How that led to that? What, what video game was y'all playing? What type of bet, what, what type of bets y'all engaging in? What, what type of shit is you niggas doing around these motherfucking parts? Nigga, we're two teammates, nigga. 
I'd rather you nigga do what Gilbert Arenas them did. Get into it and one nigga bring a gun and scare everybody than do this shit here. We much rather you nigga bring guns and kill each other than to go to this shit here. No, I'd rather support black on black crime, nigga killing niggas, nigga keep dying in the street than two niggas doing one another like this here. <laughs> I wouldn't bullshit. I'd rather you nigga kill one another. What they were fighting for over some hood shit? Good. Good, boy, glad they wasn't fucking. Boy, we can rewind this, and one of you niggas can kill one another in the locker room behind some stupid gang shit. We would much rather have that shit and holler long live Jalen or long live the other yellow nigga. Man, but this shit here, can't nobody clap for this shit, nigga. Not even the punks. Yeah, just the, the LGBT community can't even to clap for this. Yeah, you niggas got to make up to us. Did now listen, if y'all ain't real homosexual, Y'all got to make up. Y'all got to go. Y'all got to say, listen, let's sign a petition. If these two niggas ain't real homosexual, they got to do community service for the LGBT community for 90 days. They got 90 days of motherfucking community service with the LGBT community if these two niggas ain't real sissies. Other than that, they ass in trouble with me. I'm not bullshit. Man, fuck the NBA. I'm for the boycott tape, mother. If they don't shame you niggas ass like they did Colin Kaepernick, motherfucking ass. Boy, I'm for the, man, I'm for the, fuck the NBA. Nigga, I'm not, fuck LeBron and every goddamn body. If y'all don't say nothing about this shit here, fuck the NBA, nigga. Bitch ass nigga. My son can't wear an NBA jersey. My grandkids can't wear an NBA. My family will would despise the NBA going forward if y'all don't make these two niggas come out the closet and say, yeah, we real sissies and we've been sneaking and fucking and this is our way of coming out. If y'all don't do that, second option, volunteer with the LGBT community, some organization for 90 days. The transgender kids probably or something, but you niggas ain't fit to remain amongst us heterosexual men and think we fit to Thank this motherfucking NBA. Fuck you, niggas, nigga. Michael Jordan, too. Fuck everything about the NBA, my nigga. Fuck that shit. I never in my life go to another NBA bay if y'all don't shame these two punks. And that's exactly what they are. They not homosexual men. They punks. Nigga, it's a difference. I don't know the difference, but it's a difference. <laughs> No, man, I'm mad in the motherfucker, man. They gonna trade one of the niggas. Yeah, he need to be traded. But the nigga that had him laying out. Man, I'm sick of, man. I'm, somebody got, man, this, I'm, I'm never in my life. I don't watch the shit no way. Every now and then when I'm hanging out with Antoine Daniel, I go hang out. Man, I ain't never in my life ever stepping foot in another motherfucking NBA basketball game in my life. I put that on my dead motherfucking daddy grave, nigga. Fuck you tall, giraffe ass, long leg ass nigga. Fuck you nigga. You nigga ain't good for nothing, no way. Bitch ass, I hate these hoe ass nigga. These hoe ass nigga done let these nigga do it and the team okay with it. It's supposed to be some statements made. Some bold motherfucking statements saying we are not in agreement with what y'all saw between them two yellow ass niggas. That's what them that's what two yellow cousins do in the family. Yeah, start watching your yellow cousins. Start paying attention to your two yellow cousins when they're in there playing that motherfucking game. They doing that kind of shit. Two black ass cousins be fighting, jumping on the bed, putting holes in the wall, turning black filth. Them yellow boys, you gotta watch them motherfucker. Yeah, no, nah, man, there's gonna be some bold statements coming. I said, nah, man, we don't do this in our locker room. We don't know what them niggas doing. We don't want to play with them niggas no more. Them niggas came, I ain't backing him down. He dribbled, let him through and score. Yeah, when he get the ball, y'all didn't let him through and score. He can run up 100 points. Fuck it, punk. Ain't nobody guarding you. Ain't nobody for to put their hips next to your hip to try to steal the ball. None of that shit, nigga. And I hope the NBA play this to your punk ass, nigga. Ain't no ball. Let him through. Let him run him up. Let him through, y'all. Let him score all he want to. Yeah, guard him on the three-point line. But if he got to come in and make body contact, all right. Yeah, that, that nigga right here takes some booty. Yeah, I, you saw how that boy there takes him some booty. He get full of whatever kind of drug them NBA niggas like to take and pass the drug test. He'll take him some booty. 
We just saw that nigga. You can't tell. You can't tell little nothing, boy. Jalen Green, whatever your motherfucking name is, boy. And the nigga laying there taking it. Oh man, that nigga was just so submissive in a motherfucker. He been on his dick. Man, ain't no ain't no strong man in the world can lay there and calmly and nigga peacefully. Nigga just take a. I wouldn't. There ain't no demonstration in the world can keep a nigga. Even them UFC nigga kick and turn. When a nigga got him pinned down, what them UFC nigga coming by all kind of ways to get out their position? That nigga just lays out. Oh, boy, I'm telling you, man, fuck this, man. I'm, tell, I'm done. I'm telling you, I, I've been through with this shit. But nigga, I used to, man, I'm not, I used to go on the court side and shake hands with them nigga and, and say, oh, look, y'all, I'm on the court side. See, nan and the boo boo. But nigga, I'm no longer joined. I'm no, I don't, because from this point on, you can't make me believe. That the NBA is a gay organization. And I'm finna start saying, man, I'm not watching them gay ass niggas. Them, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. I, from this point on, I'm telling my son, I'm telling my daughter, I'm telling every kid I know, if you join the NBA, just like the WNBA, you join a gay organization. Gay women and gay men, athletically built, with a lot of agility. That's what I'm gonna start describing to me. Fuck the Mavericks. I ain't never watched the Mavericks. All them goddamn white boys. Nigga, I ain't watched the Mavericks since Michael Fendi and that other nigga left. Terry, whatever that nigga name is. I ain't in no white boy beating niggas in basketball. I'm not fit to support a team full of white boys that can shoot three-pointers, can't dunk, and can win a championship. I've never been in support of no such thing. Never. Look, got me fucked up. I'm a nigga loving that nigga. Fuck no Dirk Nowinski. I ain't never like no German nigga. Fucking wrong with you. He like a Jew to me. He I ain't like no German nigga. <laughs> Damn, I almost hit a Tesla. Cause better keep them Jews up and have all kind of bad luck. But yeah, nigga, I don't like Germans. Fuck, I'm gonna like Dirk Nowinski for. I ain't with Hitler. I'm with uh, Muammar Gaddafi. <laughs> yeah, and Saddam motherfucking ass. I was a fan of Saddam, nigga. <laughs> and Kim Ong Jong. Them two motherfuckers. I ain't like no motherfucking Hitler. But yeah, now nah, man, I'm swearing up and down. Uh, yeah, the NBA is a gay organization. I don't mind. I, I listen when the NBA niggas see me, let me be. I don't want to fight none of you tall niggas. I don't want to argue with none of you tall niggas. Cause I gotta look up and talk to you. So I don't want nothing to do with you niggas. You NBA niggas, from now on when you see me, don't even say nothing. Cause I'm swearing you niggas know about this shit and y'all been keeping this a secret. <laughs> <laughs> so you keep getting your motherfucking sports pension. Yeah, you nigga can't make me believe y'all ain't know about this, nigga. And y'all keeping it a secret from us. Nigga letting our boys go up there. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to the ball daddy. Yeah, that ball nigga. That LaVar ball nigga. Him and his boys. Shout out to them nigga. You raised some strong yellow boys, my nigga. Shit, fuck it. You talking about you raised some strong mixed niggas. Dressing them niggas just some bullshit. Yeah, 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 let me go before I have another Rick. I'm uh, about to have another Rick. I ain't hit nothing. But so don't y'all be lying. Charles man, Rick. Talking about the Jews on the highway. No, I didn't. I almost hit a Tesla. Because I didn't use my blinker and look that way. Because I was a distracted driver talking on the Instagram live. But I didn't. Yeah, motherfucker. <laughs>